Hi YouTube, it's me again. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the R4, a slot one flash cart for the DS. It boots from a micro SD card. And when you save, when the R4 saves the game, it goes right into the micro SD. Now I'm just going to show you the, well, just the art for, of course. As you can see, it's loading. And you can put skin, there's different types of skins you can put on for the menu. This is a skin I made this Pokemon. As you can see, and there's three different options that you get when you go to the menu. And there's game, multimedia, and boot slot too. Now first I'll go over multimedia. Now multimedia can do all sorts of stuff. Play videos and music is pretty much it. And as you can see I'm playing the Halo 3 trailer. Now I'm not going to go through the whole trailer. Yeah. Now, you, and the cool thing is, you can press, when you press start, it leads right back to the main menu of the R4. That only works when you're in certain places on the R4 or not, in actual DS ROMs. The R4, of course, does not run GBA ROMs, nor... Well, it just doesn't run GBA ROMs, of course, because it's a slot 1 device. Slot 1 flash cart. Boot slot 2 is boot, just boots GBA games already in the GBA port. Now, here's what I mean. This is not a GBA ROM. That's a Game Boy game, as you see. It's booting. Now I'm going to show you games. As you see, I have many homebrew appli applications on this, and the R4 runs pretty good. And it's from the best flash carts out there. And what you could do is when it, well when it runs a DS game, it's fast, good, goes at same speed as a regular DS game. Let's try. Sh I'm gonna show you. Let's see. Um. I got about, I'm going to show you Marvel Nemesis, before I do that, down, it's, down here, as you can see, there's a little icon right there, that basically shows you the game, and the info, like, who made it, Marvel, the name of the game, and who made it, and it was made by Electronic Arts, and you can also cheat with the game. Press Y to cheat. Now, today I'm just going to be doing a quick review. But first, I'm just going to show you the action replay cheat. Like, you could use the action replay software to put in your cheats, but this is just going to be a quick review, because I can't. Because my camera's only low on battery, so... I just want to say, overall, I give it about, this is highly recommended for a flash cart, but if you want GBA games, don't get this, get the Easy Flash, Easy Flash, and that's mostly it, overall, I'll give it a 7.3.